Hello, boys and girls, and welcome to Avocado English. Today, we're going to do an unboxing video of a toy that I just got. The name of this toy, and it's kind of a model actually, is very difficult to say. So let's say it slowly. An O Mal O Carsis. Anomala Carsis. Anomala Anomala Carsis. So what is this creature? Well, this is a very interesting creature because this is actually one of the Earth's first giant predators. It lived in the Cambrian period, which is about, oh, I don't know, I think about 540 million years ago. It's actually one of the first creatures that ever uh, uh, came, to, came to being. Um, this was one of the first super predators. So what exactly is a super predator? Well, a predator is any animal that eats other animals. So, for example, a spider would be a predator. But this creature is a super predator. So, what's a super predator today? Well, that would be an animal like a tiger. In dinosaur times, it would be an animal like a Tyrannosaurus. So, basically, it's like one of the giant predators of its time period. Now, this creature was about one meter long, which is about 3.3 feet. Now that doesn't sound so big, but the other creatures which it ate in this time of invertebrates, that is animals without backbones, uh, those other creatures were about 6 inches, 8 inches, 25 inches, they were very small. So this creature must have been gigantic. Uh, it would be like the equivalent of an elephant next to a mouse. So let's take a look at this toy. It's so cool. Uh, this is a toy from Korea, and you can actually see its name in Hangul. It is Anomarokarisu, and it's from a it's from a company called Mikard, Mikard, which looks like some kind of uh, some kind of like monster catching game, maybe like Pokemon. I'm not sure. Um, but I actually bought this because I like this uh, creature. Uh, I've never seen a toy of this creature, so I was very surprised to see it in the shop. So let's take a look at it. Let's open up this box. Oh, looks very interesting. It's in bubble wrap. And as you can see in the box here, this actually comes with two versions. The uh, realistic version and then like a cute version. I'm opening the bubble wrap slowly. Oh my gosh, look at this creature. eating tendrils so it would swim hover over its prey it would grab its prey and bring it up into its mouth and it had very brilliant eyes it had some of the first uh, first multifaceted eyes and if you were to think about a modern animal this kind of reminds me of the mantis shrimp almost but this would be a giant version now one thing that's very interesting about this animal is when scientists first discovered it, they didn't realize what it was. They thought the body and the head were two different creatures. And they thought it was a, a type of sponge and I'm not sure what the other part was, but uh, they thought it was two different animals. I'm really impressed with this. This actually looks almost like something you would see in a museum or in a, uh, like a medical uh, specimen. So here's the toy, uh, cute version. Woo, look at that one. Cute. You can pretend it's the baby, but uh, in reality, its proportions are a little bit off. Its head is too big. It's kind of like the super cute version of it. Personally, I like the realistic version, but I'll show you the cute version for those of you who are interested. What a cute little baby, baby version. Whoa. 
got its little mouth there. So this toy line, pretty cool. I might pick up a few more. I saw they had a creature, uh, Dunkelosteus, which is a prehistoric uh, fish, uh, which I also like. So very amazing to see uh, some of these rare prehistoric creatures being made into models and toys. Amazing. I love it. I want to display it on a on a stand so it looks like it's swimming like so. Alright, thank you boys and girls. I hope you enjoyed today's unboxing video and I hope you learned a little bit today as well. Bye bye!